We had no other choice. Matt Parkman had to turn Siler into Nathan, and as I recall, you were in on it. I made an emotional decision because I didn't want to see you lose your son, but it was wrong. We have Matt Parkman with his dirty secret, you know, Nate and you know Nathan Petrelli and you know Siler going through the Jekyll and Hyde thing. Claire just trying to want to go back to the, her own back, you know, a regular world. <laughs> For Hero, it comes in the form of the bucket list. You know, he has a terminal illness, and because of that, you know, he's trying to make the best out of what he feels is the remaining of his life. But then he realizes, instead of the bucket list being, you know, things that he wants to do, like explore and stuff, he realizes the, his mission is to right the wrongs he's done in the past. I have a gift, Hero. Just like you. New characters involves the, the carnival folks. You know, Samuel, played by uh, Robert Nepper. The carnival is kind of like a, a traveling carnival, but it surpasses dimensions. It you know teleports, you know, it time travels as well. Kind of similar to what Heroes Powers is, uh, and it's it's a big mystery. You know, we can't really tell if it's going to be good or evil. I'm Gretchen Berg. Who are you? I'm Claire Bennett. Hayden and her roommate has a kiss. <laughs> no, there's not much more to it. I mean. Well, I mean, is it romantic? Is it just a friendship kiss? Is it an accidental kiss? That's a wait and see thing. We're asking the audience to kind of go on this journey with Hiro in terms of his, you know, what he feels is the, his last days. And if we all of a sudden say, oh, yoink, you know, it, it was just like the common cold, it doesn't matter, then I think we really, you know, um, to the audience in many ways. And we kind of did that in the past with Nathan Petrelli, where death doesn't have any weight. What made season one great is, you know, when uh, you know Isaac Mendez died, when Simone died, it had weight because it was final. There was a finale to it. And I think it's important to reinstall that uh, sense of danger again, sense of, uh, you know, being on the edge of the sea that this could happen to anyone. <laughs> Thank you.